Hi kiddos. When I was a kid, I really loved to draw dinosaurs. They were my favorite. Okay. You started with the shape, the ground. You'd add some legs to that thing. Squiggle, head, tongue, tail. Boom. There's a bronchiosaurus. Okay. Or excuse me, a brontosaurus? Yeah. I don't know. It's been a while since I've drawn these things, but I figured it'd be fun to share with you so you have something to do while you're at home. All right, T-Rex, big guy. He has big giant mouth, teeth, eyes, neck, tiny, tiny, tiny little fingers, uh, tail, legs, oval, oval. See how they go back and forth? One goes this way, one goes this way. Triangle for the foot, claws, curved claws, boom. Okay, back claw, more fierce. Rawr. Then you can draw the ground down here, and of course, oh no, it's Miss Eminem. Run away, run away. Okay, we got the T Rex. Now, raptors, lots of little kiddos like those. Let's start with the ground, his body, his tail, his leg, just like the T Rex, just a little skinnier triangle toes. Okay, hiding part of his leg. All right, his arms are a little bit longer. And three claws, there we go. And his neck, head, nose, teeth, vicious teeth, pointed eyes. And if you want, you can add some spikes. I know that these things were color covered in feathers now, but I didn't know that as a kid. And if you want to draw his other leg, you can draw his other leg, it would be over here and his little toes and then you'd be like whoa run whoa scared okay all right next well, let's see oh my favorite flying dude little body okay this is gonna be a pterodactyl head beak eye Wings, little feet, maybe a little tail. And you come back with the wings like this. If you want the wings to have a line in them or some details in them, look a little more like a bat wing, you go down and then across like this, down and then across, okay? All right, kiddos, there's your dino fun for the day. Thanks for watching and drawing with Miss Eminem.